Yes, baby. What, Bubba? What? Love you. <laughs> Love you. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Um, me and Soy have a couple things planned today. Nothing too crazy, but we... I am looking for some new cleaning products. So I think I'm going to run to Target and grab some stuff because I'm all out of a lot of things right now. Um, but I do want to try a more... Okay, so I did a cleaning video a while ago, like months ago, when I kind of first started my channel. And all my cleaning products that I used are ones that have been around forever. And they are chemical products. I'm not huge on the whole, like chemical ban thing, you know, like all use, all natural, all stuff all the time. Um, I know that it's healthier for you. I get that, but in my head, I just don't, it do, nothing cleans like chemicals. You know what I mean? Like nothing is going to, I don't know. That's just how I feel. And I'm like, I haven't looked up any, any of that kind of stuff. So I have no idea, but I just feel like, you know, Lysol does what Lysol is supposed to do. And my organic mint and orange uh, surface cleaner that does not tell me how many germs it cleans it just says surface cleaner um, doesn't do what I want it to do you know um, but I could be wrong so I'm gonna go to Target and try and find some more natural alternatives but I want to see how much I want them to kill germs I want it to be effective in that area so I don't know, I'm gonna go see, and I'm probably gonna grab some stuff to just test out for a little bit. I need to replace Clorox wipes, and I need a countertop spray. Um, I do have one right now from um, a friend I actually met here on YouTube. Um, so it is this, and she always raved about it, so I had to grab it. And I love how it smells and I love how it leaves no film on my countertops because when I use my um, Mrs. Meyers surface cleaner, it leaves like this really yucky film. I love the smell of that one, but it leaves this really weird like feel to my countertops and I don't love that. So this one doesn't do that. It feels very clean. It smells incredible, but it doesn't, and it says multi-surface cleaner cuts grease. Um, but my only issue with it is it doesn't tell me how many germs it kills. So I just, um, I want to see that, you know, like versus you grab something like Lysol kills 99.9% .9 of viruses and bacteria. And these, all, the, these kill the flu virus too, which I think is really cool. And so like, I'm just kind of comparing it to that. I have all my cleaners. Um, yeah, so that's my only issue with this is like, should I be using it when Sawyer accidentally has an accident and pees um, around the toilet? You know what I mean? Like, is it going to kill those germs or is this just to kind of clean something that's not really dirty? I don't know. If you guys understand what I'm saying, um, I probably just confused the heck out of everybody. But so that is my goal today. Also, my mom has been watching soy for me for a couple weeks while I've been going to the gym and I have been going to the gym like four days a week and I know it she you know works all day and then she comes home and watches Sawyer for about an hour and a half sometimes to two hours and I just I appreciate I don't think she knows how much I appreciate that because um most of you guys who watch my channel know that it's very hard for me to leave Sawyer. I never go out with friends. Me and Ryan never have date nights. It's honestly been like a handful of times since I've left him. I think he's stayed with my mom overnight maybe maybe three times, three or four times, and he's two and a half. So, um, you know, I just it's just not something that comes easy to me. Um, I just worry too much. And anyways, I really wanted to make this a priority going to the gym a priority i think it's healthy for me to have a little bit of a second to myself and and just give my myself that um in the way that it has made me feel is just something i was not expecting it has just made me i don't know it's just i really love that time now and um but now i'm feeling bad you know because i don't know i just feel bad i don't want 
how do I explain that? You know, my mom's hardworking, and I don't. <laughs> I don't know, I'm feeling bad. I'm not necessarily leaving him because I know he's safe with her and I'm just going to the gym for a couple hours. Um, but this is more of a guilt. I, like, I feel really bad for saying, hey, can you watch my baby while I go to the gym? So, um, but if you're watching mom, it literally means so much to me because it has just done so much. I just feel like, um, I can't even get my words out. I'm like playing with this piece of kinetic sand because I'm feeling like awkward and nervous. But it just means a lot to me. It's helped me so much. I feel like I have a second to breathe and it's amazing because I literally haven't had that in like so long. And um, I'm learning stuff in the gym. Anyways, blah, blah, blah. I'm annoying. Uh, so yeah, we are going to go to Target and I'm going to see if I can find some cleaning stuff. And if my mom's home, I'm going to take her for the ride. So let's see. <laughs> No, that's food. Oh. <laughs> I got him right here. I just hit him in the head with my phone. Sweet. That was a fun target moment. Please get a venti ice cream tea with extra ice and no classic. Thank you. And a chocolate chip cookie. How does how is that? Do you like it? Yeah, interesting. It is interesting. I didn't ever think about it. Guys, I am home. Moyer is watching Monsters Inc. I do not have a babysitter, so I won't be going to the gym. So I'm gonna do a home workout after dinner, which could be a bad idea because I might be, you know, my dinner. But uh, we're gonna do it anyways. So I have my Body Boss workout program, and I will do one of those tonight. Um, but it's already later, so I'm gonna hurry up and get dinner going because it's like six o'clock. So what we're having for dinner is some rice. I'm just making some jasmine rice in my rice cooker. And then I'm heating up my pan. I have some olive oil in there. This one is my favorite olive oil. I know that sounds like a weird thing to have a favorite with, but I feel like a lot of them give off a, I don't know, a weird taste. So this one's my favorite. I get it at Safeway. And then, um, I have my chicken right here, and I'm going to try out this mandarin teriyaki sauce. So I'm going to cook it up in here and then add some of this sauce to it. And I went to Target to get a veggie. Well, I didn't go to Target to get a veggie. I was at Target, and while I was at Target, I thought that I needed a veggie. So I went to go look at the veggies they had, but um, they didn't look very good, which is weird for Target because I feel like they're groceries are usually pretty like on point um, more pricey but usually good um, what do I want to use for my chicken um, so that's what we're doing and I will show you guys what I got at Target in one second Thank you. 
So he is over here eating an apple and peanut butter per his request. Okay guys, so I used, um, I poured all this sauce on the chicken while it was cooking and I let it cook fully and then I added more of the sauce. I took out my chicken pieces, I cut it all up and then I stuck it back in here and now I'm just going to toss it. The sauce is starting to like caramelize and so um, it's probably been cooking for about 20 minutes and I'm going to let it cook for, um, I don't know, who we got foggy. I'm going to let it cook for a little bit more. I like when the sauce is on the, I like when the sauce caramelizes like that and gets a little thicker because when you first pour it, it's runny, but the hotter it is and the longer you let it sit, it gets like thicker and just really good. So I'm going to let that sit for a little bit longer and then I'm just going to spoon it over our rice and my rice just finished. I like to put some, a little bit of butter in my rice with some garlic salt when I'm cooking it and it comes out really good. So that is dinner. And let me show you guys what I got at Target really quick. So the first thing that I uh, picked up were these face wipes. I was out of mine. My favorite brand is the Simple Face Wipes. Um, and this compares to Simple, so that tells you that it's the exact same thing. Target just wanted to use their brand. So these are the knockoffs for those. And I got two packs because I have to start taking my makeup off for that new face wash I showed you guys a couple days ago. Um, and then we were out of flossers. They were out of the kind that I usually get, which are the scope ones, the green scope ones. Um, so I picked up these ones. Rye flosses his teeth. Rye flosses his teeth like 90 times a day, so I always have to have those in stock. <laughs> and then I picked up a chapstick. I was out of mine, and so I just grabbed this EOS crystal one. It looked really cool, and I liked that it was melon because I love melon anything. Um, so I hope I like this because I was out of my ride or die chapstick which is the Nivea dark blue one that one's my favorite um but they didn't have those on the end camp that on the end cap that I was looking at so I grabbed this one um I got some dryer sheets this is my favorite scent the Gain um Island Fresh oh my gosh these ones just smell so good okay so what I really went to Target for mostly was new cleaning products. And I picked up a few. I decided to go with the brand Method because um, I was doing a little research and they are a more natural, they are a natural um, company and I really like what they stand for. And they are made with non-toxic non -toxic, plant-based ingredients, which I thought was really great. But what sold me on them was they had one of these, which I did not see the Mrs. Myers have and the new um, brand that I was trying out, although I loved the scent like I told you guys earlier. I didn't see them have something like this. So this is an antibacterial and it kills 99.9% .9 germs and that's what I was looking for right there. And they are still a natural brand. So I just, I loved that, that sold me. So um, you can use this anywhere. It tells you on the sides. You can use it on kitchen surfaces, countertops, height chairs, doorknobs, garbage cans. And then I got the all-purpose cleaner uh, that I had set in here first. And then I got the bathroom one, which is tough on soap scum and mildew stains, which I have a new house, so we don't have any of that going on yet. But um, I just liked that they had more of a variety than, than one bottle saying it's for bathroom and one bottle saying it's for kitchen and it has the same ingredients and nothing's different. I liked that they had an antibacterial one. So that sold me and the scents are amazing. This one is um, apple or something. Where does it say it at? Uh, Honeycrisp apple and it smells so fresh and like perfect for spring. So this one, if you guys are looking for a new cleaner, um, check it out but I can't really say that yet because I haven't used them so I'm, I have I'm really hoping that I like these because I like them I liked this one was in the scent wildflower which also smelled beautiful and then this one I believe was mint oh eucalyptus mint and I'm all about that so I'm super excited to try these um if you guys have used this brand before please let me know I'm really excited for it and then lastly I got this sweater for the gym it's like a crop sweater but not super crop my friend Tammy has one and hers is mustard, but they didn't have other colors. They were all sold out. So I picked up the gray, which is probably what I would have got anyways. 
Um, but yeah, it's like slightly cropped, and so my high waist leggings will probably come up to here, and it'll it'll um, do good. I just like working out in sweaters; it's my jam. And then I got these leggings there. Target is carrying this new brand, and you can see they're kind of like faded looking. Um, I really like that look. They kind of look distressed and like warm. But Target has a new brand called Closey, and they have some really cute stuff. And so I picked up those. So that is everything that I got from Target. And Soy is eating my dinner, you guys. He's eating my dinner, and that like excites me beyond beyond words. Um, I just chopped up some chicken um, for him with the rice, and he's all about it. He ate half of my plate and he wanted more. So we are doing great. He is watching Monsters Inc. still. Um, and then we're gonna go get in bed. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog right here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna see what we have going on in the next video, then please subscribe. And we will see you guys later. Bye.